bring them death! I held to my oath, Reeve. I hope you will honor yours. My promise holds, I. They of Ord will join you in the fight against Ruid's clan. With your aid, we may yet save East Anglia. In past times, that horn was used to muster fears all across our land. You may find others who have warmed to its call. Good. Whatever willing men you find, rally them soon at the ruins north of Burt Castle. That horn came from Elmenham. Baldis must have got to them. The brothers' fleet, gathered and ready. Can we really do this? We're just farmers and merchants. I'm safe, brother. God protects the righteous. Finally, we put my longship to use again. I was tired of it gathering dust. Our ships are sturdy, but Berg's walls are sturdy. This plan of finish is mad. Eivor! Word of your actions. Men are pouring in from across East Anglia, and our ships stand ready. The Edward's Reeve is with us. His men will be here soon. More than his, the Kingsbury Horn has inspired men all across this kingdom. We will have the army we need. It seems Oswald got what he wanted in the end. Saxon and Dane united in common cause. A pity he is not here to see it. The forces will be ready soon. Are you ready to start the assault? I am. Our target is Burr Castle, said to be impenetrable. Good. Let them have their false confidence. By cover of night, Baldus will lead the fear at the front gates. With Ruid's men distracted, our forces move on the sea gate from the backwaters at their backs. And once we're in, we'll leave no gate closed in that castle. Ruid's men cannot be allowed to dig in further. Your longship, is she ready? She awaits her own special glory. They need your word, Sable. This land you call home is on the verge of ruin. Burned and pillaged by Ruid's clan, it bears the scars of an age of endless war. But today, we will reclaim her. Today we fight for your land, and tomorrow we rebuild! For East Anglia. For East, for East Anglia. Anglia. Now is the time. Today we rid East Anglia of Ruid's clan once and for all. Your actions in Thayhorn has spread like wildfire.
Remember the dream I spoke of? You sailed through Helheim on a ship of fire. Here, it may come to pass. Dreams. Life. Maybe they are one and the same. Tonight I ride the flaming sea steed, rushing to the spear deck. The watcher I light on water's wake, another glory I will keep. Ready yourselves. Bruit's shit stains will see us coming.
that fast. This will be over soon. Worry not for me. You must stop. <coughs> Silence, fool. So this is what it comes to, Wolfkist? Two Danes fighting over a filthy Saxon horse, son? This swine is your prize. Come and get him. <coughs> Battle is not yet won, Oswald. Flee, Ruid, while pity restrains my blade. Not till I've taken all these shores have to offer. Be you. That groveling worm in a cage. You must be blind to stand with such a man. <laughs> Fighting for a Saxon king. The sagas will uh, for all your efforts. Only the cold dark of these time awaits you. Well, is my destiny. That fate will not be met today. This land is they should be ruled, wolf kissed. Made thralls, not treated as equals. We are better than this, than all of them. Do not drag me down to the sewers you wallow in. This land is rife with weakness, and you are just another blighted dog. Why does a Dane fight tooth and nail for a Saxon? This Saxon of all. He has an abundance that which you do not. He is fit to rule, fit to lead. You are not but a murderous plunderer. This land is rife with weakness, and you are just another blighted dot upon it. Nothing a little fire cannot burn. Danes, fighting for a Saxon king! The Sagas will scorn this day! I will enjoy this! Thank you. You'd throw in with these wastrels? These Argir swine? For what? A scrap of land and a promise of peace? Eivor, no! He should be tried before God, a lawful assembly. <laughs> I won't have my reign begin with more blood spilt than is needed. Another screeching skull. This man must die for the damage he has wrought. The old laws are clear. These are Oswald's lands. To rule as king as he sees fit. Does Eivor bow to kings? To defy a king would shame him. East Anglia cannot heal without his honor intact. And what of your honor, Eivor? How much are you willing to lose? The rightful king of East Anglia has spared your life today. And so it will be. Compassion. 
Compassion is a virtue suited for anyone, Eivor, including you. Thank you. Speak with Oswald. See if he's well. Ruins finish for the ship! Raise the old fire! Oswald won't live! Thank you for heeding me, Eivor. I know the worth of such a gesture. All this is... is like a dream. But you're not asleep. Well fought! Well fought! The both of you! You came as well, old friend. If I'd known you were still alive, I would have stayed in Norwich. Look around you. A happy occasion and a glorious victory. And soon, something more grand to take place. A wedding, my love. If you will still have me, that is. And why would I not? I fought poorly. I melted under the heat and anger of that brute. And I never... Oswald, stop. You fought. With all your heart and soul, that's all you need ever do. Come then. We have much to prepare for. A bride to wed and a kingdom to lead. But some men wouldn't give for such things. Countless men have died for them. And you, Veneer? Are you jealous of such things? Hardly. My heart is a fire. But my body aches. I desire only a long nap. I saw a bale of hay back there. Later, Abel. For now I must see to the wounded. Then I will see you at the wedding. Aye, of course you will. I should return to Elmenham. Oswald's wedding 